Hey folks, Odd here, just with a quick asteroid update. This asteroid's name is 2013 JM22. It's a mo it's a very recently discovered asteroid. Um, as of right now, this asteroid is pretty close to Earth at 0 0.0227 astronomical units. As you can see here, this is on spaceweather.com, 2013 JM22 today. Lunar distance is 7.9. So, and it's a 2013 rock, so they don't know much about this rock. So keep an eye out on it. Also, 2013 JR7 came in on a close approach on May 10th at a lunar distance of a missed distance of 9.1 lunar distances. The size of that one was tiny, about 18 meters. This one is 95 meters. A little bit bigger here, folks. Alright, so we're going to have to go ahead and keep an eye on that. This one right here is bigger than a football field. Alright, so now remember that. Now let me go ahead and show you, and I mean American football field. So let me go ahead and show you exactly where this rock's going to go. Alright, here we go. Let me go ahead and zoom this in for you. Alright, here you go. Now here's where 2013 JM22 is. As you can see, it's a little bit north of Earth. Now, here we go. As of right now, it's shown that today is supposed to be its close approach date at 0 .0227 astronomical units. But tomorrow, it will be 0 .0215 astronomical units, just right above the Earth. Close approach or something more. A lot of asteroids coming close to Earth already this year, folks. A lot of different stuff. And then there you go. Then it's a little bit further out. And as you could tell with this asteroid, I'm going to go ahead and zoom back out. Look at its its uh, angle. They say it has a normal orbit. It goes around out through Jupiter, back down through and through. So tomorrow, tonight through tomorrow, close approach, 215. So point zero two one five astronomical units. All right, folks, and that will be at a close approach of 7.9 lunar distances. The size, remember, 95 meters. Close approach today, tomorrow. So we'll keep our eyes out on this rock. It is one of the closest so far on this chart. Besides down here for July 29th at 7.6 lunar distances. Remember, NASA's always finding more and more of these rocks. So just pay attention out there, folks. Keep your eyes to the skies. Also, remember, we also have a solar flare potential. Right now, X class is at 60%, M class 80%, C class 100% for the next 48 hours. So there you go, folks. If there's any latent breaking news in the sun or pretty much anywhere else, also earthquakes, I will update you throughout the night. Much love and may God bless.